Hey guys, it's Pinkmon, and welcome back to the Not So Berry Challenge. This is the fourth part in a row that I'm filming today because, I don't know, I'm on a roll and the construction guys aren't here, so I'm just trying to do it as fast as I can before they get here. <laughs> Wait. She's talking to Bjorn. Oh no. So there's this glitch. I don't know if you guys have experienced this too, but I have on this game and then on my crappy save file on my my laptop where if you have like a baby daddy he'll just randomly invite himself in when the kid is like a baby or a toddler and he'll just come into your house and you can't ask him to leave and I have to use a cheat to make him leave and they just come like all the time does this happen to anyone else or is that just me because it's so annoying like he just walks right in and I have no control over it unless I cheat which we're gonna do because I don't want him to have any type of relationship with her. Um, MC cheats, makes him leave. So if you ever see him here, I'm just gonna use that cheat because, yeah. Get up, dude. So she's starving. Should I, oh, there's food right here, lucky you. Are they still sleeping? Let's see. Yep. She's not doing so good. He's just hungry. I think I'll let them sleep till like noon. Be terrible parents. Well, he's not really a parent. He's not even technically a stepdad yet because they're just dating. Last time we figured out that Akira has two... <laughs> Not even girlfriends, they're just lovebirds, which means basically they just mess around with each other. And both of them are married too. And it looks like he has a thing for married blondes. I don't know, maybe he just likes any type of girl. But it's gross. Can't believe he's already cheating. I was gonna make him cheat, but he's already doing it on his own. Yeah, so today we're just mostly having Peppa and Akira go on a date, and then I'm gonna go with Akira afterwards and have him mess around with his two mistresses. And I don't think I want Peppa to find out yet, not until they're already married, because then they can get divorced. And I do want them to have at least one kid together. Because I want more than one for this generation. I kind of wanted her to have like a lot of kids. Parent of the year award. Partying until 6 in the morning. Coming back and sleeping till like noon. Just mom of the year. Also getting into her second fight last time. <laughs> Alright, it's past noon. I'm waking them up. They're still not even fully rested. Probably need a better bed but I think this is the only mint one so she's gonna have to get over it I'll have him wake up maybe go eat maybe he can cook something make himself useful something that Peppa can actually eat mac and cheese Blech. gross disgusting what does he want to do he wants to <laughs> woohoo with her and flirt with her it's interesting he's only thinking about Peppa when he has two other girls on the side. Of course she broke the toilet. We'll have him deal with that. Oh god. Is he gonna start a fire? If he does, we better invite over... What's her name? Nina Caliente. I'm determined to kill her in a fire. She better keep working at the scientist career. Sometimes they just randomly quit. So, hopefully she doesn't do that, because... We need to start a fire. We could do it with fireworks, we could... How else can you make a fire in there? I don't know, but we'll figure it out. Or we could just... Maybe... <laughs> put one of those campfires there and like... Or like surround Nina with camp... Ooh, that's a good idea. I wonder if I could do that. 
like put Nina in the middle and just put those campfires all around her and then just keep adding logs. <laughs> I've never seen that done. I don't know if it's possible, but I definitely want to try it. Oh my god, why is Bjorn back? Dude, this is so annoying. I'm gonna have to keep doing this. They need to fix this glitch. Whenever he finishes this, I'll have him ask her on a date. And I didn't put in restaurants again, oops. I think I'll like pause to do that and then I'll just like skip to when they're going to a restaurant. Cause I hate that there's no restaurants in this world. Just getting a phone call. Dude. Stop talking to us. We need to like not be friends with him anymore so he stops talking to us. Okay. I'm going to add a bunch of lots to the empty spaces and I'll see you when they're going on a date. Anyways, what was I even going to do? Oh, I was going to have them go on a date. So let's do that. They both called out of work. Ask on date. I didn't even think about where we should go, but I think we're gonna go to a restaurant. No, they're not even hungry. I shouldn't have had them eat. I think we're just gonna go to this little cafe because they can just have a drink instead of eating stuff. If they get hungry, then they can get a snack there. So the barista's just chilling over here as usual. I have so many problems with the cafes in this game. I think they're even worse than the restaurants, like when you order a drink or whatever. Uh, no. Whoa. <laughs> nice song there, buddy. We got another barista, I guess. Are you working or? <laughs> We'll just have him sit here until that guy decides to actually start working. Why are you sitting over there being awkward? Okay, we have to tell our date a story. Oops. And have them both be flirty. Well, he's already flirty. Did she just get a breakthrough? Nice. That means I think we can get a promotion. Probably won't be next time, but at least this week we can. I oh don't know. Why is he happy? He should be flirty. Oh, he can serenade her. What's his singing skill? Seven, that's pretty good. Ooh, what? Why are you going way over there? Uh oh. Looks like we can finally order stuff. So let's get a mocha, right? Yeah. I wish you could get like ice mocha. That's my favorite drink. That is my weakness from Starbucks, the white chocolate ice mocha. Ugh, so good. Oh, he's still singing? All right, that's enough of that. He'll get, um, Americano, I guess. <sighs> Keep getting water. Oh my god, I hate the baristas here so much. Like, can you please do your job? Why does she keep trying to get water? 
Just getting their damn drinks <laughs> takes so much effort. Is he getting water? Come on, dude. <laughs> okay, Anderson Panero, I think I think you need to be fired. Let's just give up on the drinks. I don't even care. I'm so over that. Let's just try to get a gold medal date. Deep conversation. Wonder if it'll count if she does one of them. Well, she's feeling flirty. Let's try to get him flirty too. He's still not flirty? Yeah, so I think maybe in the next part, or maybe like on Saturday their time, I can get them engaged. Stop feeling confident. You're not that great. Oh, it's from serenading. I really regret doing that now. Where's she going? Stop. Just give up. Or just do whatever you want because you're in charge. He might actually be making it this time. That's amazing. Wow, it's a miracle. She got an espresso. I'm gonna have him try to steal any. Oh, never mind. Okay. He needs to get flirty so he can get this gold medal. Oh, we could ask a risque question. She's already tired. You slept till noon. Maybe if we just have him get up and start doing stuff like kissing, embracing. Okay, <laughs> they finally did it. <laughs> now it's gold. And it's already nighttime. I'm gonna have them end this date. And I'm gonna have Akira go out with one of his side pieces. Alright, so he ended up coming to this nightclub with Kiera Munch, and we also got a, oops, this achievement, just getting started, play The Sims 4 for five hours. <laughs> yeah, I played it way more than five hours, but whatever. So let's just start flirting with her. We probably haven't even had our first kiss technically according to the game, but have they? Am I just missing it? <laughs> it's not even an option yet. Interesting. He has to pee. I'm gonna have him go pee. And the reason I came to this nightclub is there's closets here. <laughs> so you know what he's going to do, right? Let's have them come dance together. Guess he's into all types of chicks, cause this girl is way older than him. Why is he way over there? Flirt. Kiss her hands. We're just gonna pretend that they've already kissed before, cause it doesn't really make sense for their romance to be that high if they haven't. Impressed with video game prowess? <laughs> 
Did she just like reject him? Oh no, oh no, oh no. All right, you know what? <laughs> For storytelling purposes, I'm gonna cheat their relationship up. Cause this isn't really related to the challenge at all. Doesn't really matter if I cheat, so. First kiss, but it's not really their first kiss. Get on with it. Um, what's going on? <laughs> there we go. Oh no, what? That doesn't even make sense. I can't say sorry. All right, let's just get out of this awkward thing and then they should be able to do it. Makes no sense when their romance bar is that high that she would have rejected that, but. I guess because they were still in the awkward conversation. Please take it this time. Okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> Attempt to seduce her. Did she leave? She's making him run all the way over here to do this. Damn. Screenshot. <laughs> all right. I wonder if I do woohoo if they'll run all the way back to that closet. No, we're not trying for a baby. Woohoo. Though it might be cool if he had a second family. But I don't think this let's play is that deep. <laughs> After this, we're gonna get with Summer. <laughs> we're gonna try to do all of them in one night. I know that's messed up. Oh, <laughs> he's invisible. <laughs> we don't need to say bye to all these people. <laughs> Malcolm's into it. <laughs> well, now it's five in the morning, so. Oh no. <laughs> Your recent amorous activity has revealed that Kiera is an alien. What? Oh my god. <laughs> I don't even want to know how that was revealed. But. Mm. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. <laughs> now we're gonna disband this group. And he's gonna go try to get with Summer too. Okay, so we came to this park because they can woohoo in this observatory. We might have to cheat again with their relationship, but we'll see how it goes. Ew, he stinks. His knees are horrible. She's not into it. Are you? Ugh, that doesn't make any sense. He's gonna pass out. Good job, dude. Good job. Hopefully that doesn't disband their group. I am gonna cheat their relationship too. Let me just get them out of the awkward thing. Smintina. Droba. Okay. Okay, she should take it this time. Again, we're pretending this is not their first kiss. Yibs. 
Should be able to woohoo now. <laughs> it makes sense that he's this dirty with how many people he's getting with in one night. Oh. No. I didn't say you could go take a bath. You can take one after. You're about to get dirty anyway. <laughs> this is going to happen before this part ends. Like, I don't care how long it takes. <laughs> Finally, after the third attempt. Oh no, Kiera is texting him. <laughs> She's asking him on a date. He has work in 10 minutes. He's just gonna have to be late. What's what's happening? <laughs> Ooh. It doesn't say he's doing any action, but he's he's stuck in there. No. No! This needs to happen. Don't go to work. I don't give a crap about your job right now. No, we are not saying goodbye. Finally. His needs could not be worse. Did that even count? Okay. Well, that could have been with the other girl. <laughs> Was it that good, Akira? Was it that good? Well, we're just gonna say it happened, and we're gonna send him to work. Ah, uh, that means Pep is at work, so we don't get to see her during this workday. That's okay, because I think this part has gone on really long, so I'm gonna end it right here. If you enjoyed, please consider subscribing or leaving a like, and I'll see you next time. Bye!